extremely proud of, of our guys. Um, we've spent uh, the better part of three days um, really trying to get back to our identity and who we are. Um, offensively, we haven't been that far off in these three losses. Um, but defensively, I think we've been way off. And I, we've said it that I, uh, we haven't been very tough to play against and we've had slippage in our principles. And tonight, um, I thought we really fought. Well, we missed some open shots, and I've told the guys that stuff will happen. Um, but I thought we did a really good job. We turned them over 10 times at, at Cal, 15 times tonight. Um, and, and I thought other, you know, they're a very, very good offensive rebounding team. But um, I just thought we fought. I thought we had some toughness to us tonight. Uh, one game doesn't make it, but um, our defensive efficiency was like 85. Uh, we haven't been there in, in quite some time. So. Um, really proud of them just taking what we've been doing in practice this week uh, and then put it into gameplay. You saw Tom go down there uh, in the first half, probably you know not knowing the certainty of, of his situation, how hard was that, and, and uh, going forward, obviously he returned, but uh, any lingering concerns? Well, it, you know, you just always hate any of your players going down, and uh, Tom's worked so hard. <laughs> if you look at Tom, I mean, just look at his last month. You know, if he's broke his nose. Um, you know, actually, if you go back to October, he broke his nose. Uh, he set out for a while, or September. He set out a while for that, healed, comes back early January, breaks his nose, um, has to wear a mask. He's wore a mask in every league game but two. Um, and he just continues to get a double double tonight. Uh, ends up getting seven and five, came back, made some huge plays for us, both offensively and defensively, dives on the floor for a loose ball in the second half. Um, you know, so we don't know the extent, but I think it's good news that he was able to come back. Uh, so at least that's good news. And now uh, I'll just let the medical staff do what they got to do to figure out kind of where we move from here. But um, just really pleased for him because that nose has been stitched three times this year already. It's just, uh, he's an amazing guy. He just gives you everything he's got. And when I went out to see him, uh, I know he was most frustrated, most upset. Not for him. He was upset because he knows what he means to this team and he was scared. Uh, and that's just who he is. Uh, he's an incredible teammate. Uh, Steve, uh, the other day you addressed the kind of the slow starts and obviously they jumped out for that early lead there. Uh, it's kind of what, kind of, what do you kind of see there and then what do you also see in the run? that follow when you guys were able to uh, get back to Well, I, you know, I have to look at it, but I think both halves, um, we didn't get the stops that we needed to start both halves. And then once we settled down defensively, the last the last three, four minute games of each half, we were really good at defensively. Um, so now it's just the start. It's, um, it's starters and then that first row of subs, like that first flow of subs that comes in that first eight minutes, we just weren't on on point defensively, like we only miss some open shots. And any time that you miss open shots, um, being a player once, I just know how that what it does to your demeanor. Uh, then we got up, we got some stops, we got relaxed a little bit, started making some shots, um, and our energy picked up. But uh, all in all, defensively, uh, we were pretty good tonight. Guys, round score of eighteen nothing. You don't often see that Pac-12 play. Uh, and 24 to four to close the first half. Would you make a case that was your best 11 minutes of the, uh, of the season? Um, it's hard, you know, I don't know if it was our best 11, but um, I thought it was a critical 11, you know, and to do that without Tom. Um, you know, I thought Gigi came, you know, Gigi, I thought brought a lot more toughness tonight and that's what he can do. He's got such a good basketball IQ and um, I thought he played extremely hard tonight and that's what we got to have, uh, him battling. And so to do that when Tom wasn't out there for us, that's, a, that's at least encouraging and some of these guys can build some confidence from that. Coach, you had Jalen in the starting lineup, I think, for the first time since November. What went into that decision? How do you think that four guard lineup uh, uh, started? We decided, we decided to change things up. Um, I don't know if it's the answer, not so much Jalen. I just don't know if, if four guards is the answer. Um, it's not the ideal weekend to probably be doing four guards on starting lineup because they're huge and Stanford's big. You know, you're looking at Humphrey and 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 Travis. So it's uh that's not easy. And, and I thought if anything it got Wilkes out of the flow. And we don't want that, uh, because he's too valuable what we're doing. 
Uh, but we just gotta look at it, make some tweaks maybe with it, because I think it is something that we can go to because we're fast, we're long, we're athletic. As long as we can rebound and defend without getting in foul trouble, um, I think we can do more of that, but we can't have Wilkes getting out of flow and out of rhythm and getting in foul trouble guarding guys that are three and four inches taller than him. That's something we can't do. Chris Smith uh, continues to have a nice little surge here, uh, four or five tonight. Uh, not a ton of minutes, but uh, a lot of production. Out there. Yeah, I thought you know he just continues to improve, and that's what we want. You know, his you know he had 14 minutes. I think that's probably what he's averaging. Um, so. I don't think his minutes are down. Uh, that's pretty much what he's been getting. And um, those minutes go up if you just show, continue to show that consistency. And uh, I thought he did that. You know, I, I was very, very pleased with his minutes off the bench. Anything else for Coach?